Hey, Dad, did you know the gems used to travel all over outer space? <laughs> yeah, they're pretty far out, son. I think Pearl really misses going out there. <gasps> Dad, can you help me build a spaceship? You know, that might be a little outside my skill set. How about a bunk bed with wings? I could probably do that. No way! We could totally build a spaceship! People have done it before, and we're people. We are people. And Pearl would love it so much to see space again. Sure, why not? How hurt could we get? My aunt and uncle had a great love for aviation and each other. They cherished the years they spent together and they held on to every belonging they ever owned. Kind of like me and my storage shed. Starting to think our family has a problem. This is great! I hereby declare this barn to be Universe and Universe's Universal Space Travel HQ! <laughs> Okay, now. Ooh, space travel. What is this? We built a spaceship! Ugh. A spaceship? A spaceship! A spaceship. Now remember, Stephen, if you run into any trouble out there, you can always bail. There's never any shame in bailing. Fatherly advice, understood. Thank you, Dad. Light the engines. Roger that. Next up, outer space! Blast off! Oh. 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 No shame! Ah. I think your calculations may have been off. Well, they can't be off if you don't do any. Did you really think this was gonna work? Mm hmm. Here, look. You need smooth, curving surfaces, otherwise you're never gonna get enough speed to break Earth's gravitational pull. Probably swept back wings for supersonic flight, airtight cockpit with ejector seat, and we'll need some serious engines, or maybe rockets would be better. I have a rocket! Whoa, whoa, hold on a sec. We're not actually talking about building something like this, right? What? This? <laughs> of course not. That would be ridiculous. I mean, yes, theoretically, it's not a stretch. You've got plenty of spare parts here, albeit for incredibly primitive propulsion-based space travel. The idea is ludicrous. It would never work, although several humans, a monkey, and a dog did make it into space. I don't know why I've never even thought of it before. This could actually work! Uh. I hear what you're saying, and I agree. It would be incredibly dangerous. A fool's errand. This chair is disgusting. But aren't the true fools the ones who don't seize an opportunity despite all the inherent risks? And I'd be able to show Stephen the wonders of the cosmos. And maybe just for a second, from a distance, I could see what's been going on without me. 